Psycho guys, Ifan back again with another video. And today we are going to be talking about uh, how to avoid the value error in Excel. Now, let's first give you, let me give you an example and then we'll uh, see how we can, uh, what we can or should be doing to avoid it. So, uh, let me just uh, zoom in a bit here. Okay, now let's see the cell B3 has a value of 1. Cell B4 has a value of A and B5 has 3. Now, what we are trying to do is we, we're going to be adding these three cells together using the old fashioned uh, summation uh, symbol. So, uh, B3 plus B4 plus B5. There you go. Excel, what it's trying to do is trying to say, okay, 1 plus a doesn't know how to uh, add a to to anything it's, it's not numeric so the formula just breaks down here now if you want to avoid that and uh, now this a could uh, be data entered could be you know data entry or uh, could be result of another formula whatever the, the fact that there's a there's a, a non-numeric value here and you're trying to add them to numeric values the sum of uh, the, the the plus sign this formula doesn't work it breaks so how to avoid that use a sum formula okay now it says number one comma number two comma number three so you can select which numbers you want or you can also do a range so let's do it both ways so this uh, b3 comma b4 comma b5 and you close the brackets now what's doing is it takes one tries to add A to it, figures out this is non-numeric, ignores it, goes forward, finds a 3, so it takes a 1 and a 3 adds them together, gives you a 4. Now, if you notice what I did was, I put commas. Now, if it's a long range, long list of numbers, uh, long, long list, uh, putting commas can be, get pretty really, uh, tiresome, so you can also do some bracket and you can highlight the range you put and it goes back. So what it does is the, the, the beginning cell, the ending cell, and there's a colon in between. Gives you the same thing. Now, so you see how it was a, you were able to avoid the value error because a non-numeric value was in, 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 you know, in somewhere in the middle. Now, supposing you are trying to multiply. The same thing. Uh, let's uh, take 2 a and then three okay now what you are trying to do is d3 into d4 into d5 okay did not work now if you were to use the the product function and again the same is number comma number two comma so it could be d3 comma d4 comma d5 and you close your brackets and that gives you six so it's two times a doesn't work a is non-numeric so it just ignores the a keeps moving forward this next is finds a three so it takes a two multiplied by a three and gives you a six now just as we did a, uh, instead of comma we used a range so you can use a range here as well product d from d3 all the way down to d5 and gives you a six so this is a quick tip uh, to avoid the uh, the value of function the value error sorry uh, by using functions instead of uh, the, the the plus sign use the sum function instead of the multiplication uh, use the product uh, function and you can avoid uh, the errors that, that you the value error that you get if one of the values happens to be a non-numeric value all right so that's all for for this video here uh, if you like this video please uh, give it a thumbs up and if you'd like to see more videos like this uh, please subscribe to the channel thank you very much